Cross Holter with Flathead Electric Co-op. We're going to take you on a little tour of the landfill gas plant here at Flathead County. As you can see, we're standing here at the entrance to the landfill. Trucks are coming and going with trash, depositing the trash here. And we're going to take that trash and turn it into energy to power our homes right here in the Flathead Valley. Okay, we're standing here at the flare. Flathead County has been collecting and flaring, uh, which means burning, the landfill gas here for many years. So we worked out a great partnership with the county to take that gas that was already being burned and to collect it and burn it in a Caterpillar engine to create electricity. We're standing here at the working base of the landfill. This is where they take the daily trash and spread it around and bury it. A Flathead County's landfill has a capacity of about 12 million tons. Currently they have less than 3 million tons in place. So it's going to be able to take trash for a good long time. Now these putricibles, like this banana peel, are what make really good trash at these landfills. They, they uh, dissolve into a lot of landfill gas. So I'm going to go ahead and do my part right now. Hopefully that will generate 30 or 40 watts. Okay, behind me is one of the wells up here in the landfill. Uh, there were 15 wells already in place. We needed more in order to get more gas for our plant, so we put 26 more wells in. So there's 41 altogether. Now this well behind me has been uh, extended in anticipation of having more waste deposited around it. These wells were drilled into the trash, and basically the trash gets augered through and extracted, and then that old trash gets reburied at the working face. Then each well is basically perforated pipe and gravel that's installed. All the wells are connected with header pipes, and then we basically vacuum the landfill gas out of the landfill and into our power plant. In 2008, Flathead Electric applied for and received three and a half million dollars in clean renewable energy bonds, which are known as Krebs bonds. We use that money to uh, hire SCS Energy, which is a worldwide leader in landfill gas plants, and we went together with the county and built this plant. We're standing at what's known as the pressurization skid. This is where all the landfill gas gets, gets vacuumed into this point through this black pipe. It then gets cleaned up here where all the contaminants such as moisture get cleaned out. Then the actual methane gets mixed with the right amount of oxygen and gets sent through this silver pipe up here into the generator. the power plant now and right behind me in black is the radiator which is critical for cooling the engine. Right beside that in silver is the muffler which is very important in keeping the noise down. We wanted to be a good neighbor so noise suppression was very critical uh, aspect for us. When we fired up this power plant in June of 2009 it was generating about 600 kW which is what we expected. Now it's up to about 900 kW and ultimately will reach 1.6 megawatts, which is enough power to energize about 1,600 homes. Well, thanks for coming along on our tour of the landfill gas to energy plant. We're real excited about it and we think it's a great example of how various groups can work together for a real positive outcome.